This is how much we have progressed. And a little bit more. What I'm talking about? Um, you just need to wait and see. And look, I have some more enchanting tools for some reason. You might be like, oh Jeff, what you got? I have this amazing sword. Now <laughs> I'm just joking. This is a random sword from the first enchant I got smite in Northpack. I got a good pickaxe, the bow you know, and finally, after like three attempts to enchant this shit, I got silk touch. Finally. Finally. I have feather falling boots with Ah, blast protection. Might need it, might not. Creepers are fucking idiots. I have protection tree on my leggings, I don't like helms, and I have thorns, which I don't know what it is, and fire protection since I do tend to swim into lava. And look, I have more system. You already guessed what I was doing, maybe. If you haven't, you just have to wait. You just have to wait. And I don't think you know the bow, but the bow is powered. What I think in Infinity One, yeah. I need to show you something. Someone stole my enchanting room. Nah, I'm joking. I moved it. You can see. Since I'm lazy to use my silk touch, and I'm out of iron. This is all the iron. It's all the iron I have. Um, and you might be wondering, where did the enchanting enchanting room went? Well. <laughs> That's a whole nother story that I'm gonna tell you all about now. See, um, I kinda like conspiracies. It's, it adds drama to things. But this was not that much of a conspiracy. More like a side project I like. I like working with. Um, ever since I started this series, my first goal was to find a mob spawner. Or in this case, a zombie spawner. And so on, I went and searched for some, and I didn't find any at the beginning. But then again, when I was wandering off camera and looking for something to do, I came to the conclusion I need to search for another cave. And so on, I went searching for cave and see the materials that I didn't have time to pick up here. I wanted to finish this yesterday, but I went searching for materials to kind of half rails for the project because I knew the spawner is not gonna be uh, near my village or something and I went and searched for iron in caves all around uh, my spawn area and so on and so on and I found a lot I found a lot and there's still some on the railway this is actually a really really long railway and it kind of reveals a ravine, a abandoned mine shaft, as you see right now. And yeah, many caves on the way, but I found it. I found a spawner. Uh, I made a cozy room there. I decorated it, and it kind of took me, to be honest, around a maximum of two weeks or something like that. I'm not really sure. Oops. I'm not really sure. So you can go there. I already have a minecart. Whoopsies. Oh, let's put this here, so, you see, you see it, ah, uh, I think I'm on peaceful right now, because these, these shits, they, they were really, really loud, am I, no, I'm on normal, okay, okay, that's good, because when I was building this, I let them, uh, I let the zombies drop, and, yeah, I let them drop and they were extremely loud. But here's what I come up with. This is a nice design here in this place. We're gonna have a nether, nether portal, which I plan to get in the near future when I get a farm for these carrots and potatoes. Potatoes? Yeah, I didn't say that like I wanted to. And see, they're already dropping. It's not that if. <gasps> Holy shit! Well, hmm. this is kind of new. When I was testing it, the only mob that tend to spawn here was zombies. Only mobs, excuse me, were zombies. Oh, interesting. This guy can't really see me, so I don't think he's gonna explode. But I won't risk standing near him. But from the zombies, I got this much because I was enchanting like crazy 
yeah, that's a little ace into a Jim Carrey, aka the Bows. I really love Jim Carrey reference, and I have never. I moved everything. It's the exact same number here, so I just moved it from my other house. And look, all the materials I've got. So I have a lot of building materials, and I need to get this going to my other house and actually build something. Well, yeah, let's kill those. Mm, I got an achievement. Did I get this last time? And look, I have a helm from the zombie. This is actually a rare drop. I don't know how I didn't get it before. Yeah, let's put these things here. Mm. You can stay in here, helmet. I won't even use it. I don't have the time to fix it. You see more spawning in. I kind of want to enchant the sword, uh, the, the spoon. Or name my tooths. So uh, let's do that this episode because I have nothing special planned. I just wanted to show you guys everything, and after this finishes, I'll be back. All right, I have named one of my tooths, but uh, I failed to record. Anyways, I'm bringing the potatoes and the carrots. In the so I have those potatoes, carrots, and all my, my vegetables to my village, and I'm gonna plant the next episode. And here it is, the firstborn. Uh, on the way to the village, I'm gonna talk about some things and explanations. Uh, first of all, I named it like that because it's the first pick I ever enchanted. That's that's it. That's the story behind it. <laughs> not not much deal, but um, I have been kind of late. Uh, Wishing you guys a happy 200, uh, 2013, excuse me. Uh, hope you had uh, good holidays and I know work comes and it's not really a uh, well wish and well, like a good wish after it passed, but you know, it was Christmas, it was New Year's Eve. I hope you guys had a pleasant New Year and good presents for Christmas. I didn't got time to wish you off that I was concentrated on the partnership and we are getting it soon. I already signed the contract, so it's all good. We are there, baby. Just a little bit more to our functions get activated. And yeah, uh, next episode we're gonna build a farm for the carrots and the and the. <laughs> Oh, what were they called? Potatoes, I keep forgetting. And yeah, stay tuned to find out more and have a nice day, Jeff out.